Hey guys, welcome back. We are back again with another interesting topic for you. And in this video, we are going to make sticky mobile menu. And it will look very similar to some of the menu. Uh, that's the bottom navigation menu in some of the popular mobile applications. So without wasting any time, let's get started. I will call it mobile navigation menu. I will need some content. Let's go with content class. Let's do h1 is content. I will need some paragraphs here. Lorem 100. And let's go with more paragraphs. Lorem 164. Lorem 65. I don't know. Let's see how it looks. Okay. I may need more paragraphs. Paragraph with Lorem. Okay. This should be enough. See, this is enough now. Now I will make the menu. So let me create class mobile navbar and I will use a tag href. I don't have any link right now and class equals nav item class equals nav icon and finally span home okay so i have some icons here you can use any icon you want as per your convenience i'm using these icons let me replicate them let's go with four menus first one is home second one is search this one is for favorites or likes and finally the last one for profile perfect so let me call it uh, search this one favorites and finally profile see it's already here now i make need to make it a sticky at the bottom we will do it by css let's write some custom css here Let me start with a body. Uh, let's see how it looks. Let's not start with body. Let's start with uh, the mobile nav bar. So the first thing would be position fixed. I don't know where it went. So let me make it correct. Bottom. Zero left zero. Now it's here. Perfect. And also, what I want here is width 100% and display flex. Okay, it's getting into some shape now. Let me give it a background color of white. Oh, nice then justify content space around align items center okay not bad what next maybe i need some trade index let's go with some offer values yeah perfect then i could use box shadow 0 2px 10px black color with opacity of 0 0.1 not bad let me give it a height height of 60 px should be enough yeah this should be perfect now let's go to nap item display flex flex direction Flex direction could be 
column and align item center adding 8px0 color let's go with 555 and then uh, font size 12px let's see how it looks okay also i need to do text decoration text decoration none perfect maybe i need to increase the font size yeah this is good let me get it up to 20 px as it's too much this is not bad okay let me add active item as well so by default home could be active what i will do i'll add in class here and then provide css to the active class nav item with class active i'll just change the color to blue i don't know which one will look better here oh what i did here i wanted to change this one okay this is good perfect so what next let's design the icon as well nav icon font size 24 px let's go with 24 okay and then margin bottom 5px I think it's a bit on the higher side. Four, not bad. Okay. Now, if you see in the desktop view, actually, I don't want this menu in the desktop view. I just want it in the mobile view. So, what I can do here is I will write a simple media query. At the rate media, mean width. 768 px so what it does it selects all the devices which has a width greater than 768 px that means it's not a mobile phone anymore so what i will do if it is not a mobile phone and it is a bigger size screen mobile navbar i will make it to display none it's fine it's working here but when i go to text view it's not there but when i go to mobile view it's again there that's perfect and let me check see there's one problem i cannot see all the content over here so what i need to do here is for body i'll provide padding of 60 px which is the exact height of this this nap bar yeah perfect now and I see a good padding in here as well. If you don't want it, you can also do like this. This will provide only in top and bottom direction 60px and in left and right there is 0px. But I liked this thing. This is better. Okay. And finally, what I can do in the CSS is if you see in the desktop view, you might not find difference right now but you need to change one more thing body padding bottom zero i don't want padding in the desktop view perfect so there you go you can find you can easily make a mobile navigation menu in the bottom if you want it to be sticky at the top it's very easy just go there and make top zero and you will find it in the top perfect so hope you guys enjoyed this video uh, i provided a link in the video description below where you can find the source code for all these stuffs please subscribe us for more interesting and useful videos like this this much for today cheers guys